crazy. Um, you know, shit happens sometimes. My nigga Chris Rock got a chin though. <laughs> Chris Rock, yo, he's fucking retarded. I can't. The world is ruling by Shokan. 80% out of 100 is kind. Really don't care about time. Better like lime. Make a short victory mine. Got the fury like Luke Kane. Call it demands like the juice on your blade. Hold Johnny back so we stay in the cage. Raiding his Mac calls it thunder and rain. Power and rage. Gotta make sure I'm staying with the mission. Fighting for the good always cause ambition. Health bar full. I'm a Hey, what's going on you guys? It's your girl Tosh, aka Coco Bone, coming at you guys with another reaction video, hunty. Yes, honey. So, today's reaction is going to be to Diddy, Tyrese, Tiffany Haddish, Nicki Minaj, and celebrities react to Will Smith slapping Chris Rock. So I am very curious to see what they got to say after this whole catastrophe at the Oscars, or may I say this thug life moment at the Oscars. <laughs> I don't even know why I did this, because that shit ain't no quotation bars. That nigga was on some thug life. He was on some West Philly 215 bullshit is what happened, okay? But let me get my screen recorder set up, because I don't got too much more else to say. I just want to get into this video. And without further ado, let's get into this video, shall we? Crazy. Um, You know, shit happens sometimes. My nigga Chris Rock got a chin, though. <laughs> Retarded, I can't. Not thinking what I'm thinking. He got a chin. <laughs> he got <Yeah>. a chin. <laughs> so, uh, hey man, that, that slap was many years in the making right there. Ooh. Who's got something to say? Ooh. And I oh Will Smith, we got you, bro, for life. We got you. Shit was crazy. Chris Rock had that coming. That nigga is always talking a lot of shit. Gotta respect that man. Protective alpha male. Nicest man in the world. Can only take so much. Keep poking, keep poking, keep coming at me, keep coming at my wife, coming at my family. It's coming. Gotta respect it. Yeah. Gotta respect it. Will Smith did tonight was straight bullshit. Props and congratulations to him for winning the Oscar because damn it, he he's entitled it. to his opinion. I, love I the disagree. Brother and I'm proud of him, but because he protected his wife for him to commit tonight to go up on stage and slap Chris Rock like that. He's lucky he didn't get his ass kicked, particularly after the event was over. If not by Chris Rock to the fellas he had there with him, I mean, damn. Denzel and Bradley Cooper and Tyler Perry having to calm you down. Your publicist having to run out and, and calm you down. I mean, damn. Come on, bro. Come on, man. There's no excuse for it, ladies and gentlemen. Don't even try to justify it, okay? Chris Rock said it years ago. Every time black folks doing something, you know who messes it up. I never dreamed of my wildest dreams. I'd be saying that about Will Smith. A black man, Will Packer, did a phenomenal job producing the Oscars. And you do this to stain yourself, to stain the Academy Award? I don't know his name, but I know he's famous for, like, doing all, like, the little football reviews and stuff like that. But he's entitled to his opinion. I disagree. I respect Will Smith for what he did. But let's see what Tiffany Haddish had to say. Tiffany Haddish defends Will Smith slapping Chris Rock at the Oscars. When I saw a black man stand up for his wife, that meant so much to me. That's what your husband is supposed to do, right? Protect you. And Tiffany Hannah calls Will Smith slapping Chris Rock the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. And yeah, that's how I feel about it. Like, I don't know. I feel like my black community sometimes, we're very hypocritical. We preach about protecting black people women and you know protecting just the black race in general and then when you got a black man protecting his black wife now you know not to all but to some it's like oh how dare he why would he i just sometimes feel like my race or my community needs to make up their mind you know should we protect each other or should we not because will smith protect his black wife now y'all mad about that but had he wouldn't have protected his black wife then it would have been well that's your wife you're a husband you a bitch you should have done it 
somebody just always gonna talk shit, you know, but let, let's keep going. rock i don't think he would have made that joke had he known what jada recently shared but between him and the whole team at the oscars you mean to tell me not one of y'all heard this woman just share this heartbreaking story facts talk your shit nikki the husband gets a front row seat to his wife's pain he's the one consoling her drying her tears behind closed doors when those cameras go off Social media has made people feel that these husbands won't ever run into them in real life. Real shit. People too comfortable on the internet. You just got to witness in real time what happens in a man's soul when he looks over to the woman he loves and sees her holding back tears from a little joke at her expense. This is what any and every man or excuse me, this is what any and every real man feels in that instant. While y'all seeing the joke, he's seeing her pain. That's some real ass shit. Damn, Nikki had a lot to say. Imagine what it must feel like to be losing your hair to the point where you have to shave it bald. You think that's easy to deal with for anyone. You don't think she's cried about that many times. 2022, y'all gonna have to see these men about those jokes you made about their wives. That's true. Lil' Kim was just saying, big facts, stay focused. Oh, I think she was responding to his speech that he gave at the end. But she said, big facts, stay focused. The devil is real busy right now. They can't stand the taste of their own medicine. Karma is a bitch for real, and she ain't playing with y'all. Okay, that's some real shit. <laughs> spent two years in lockdown i get it now <laughs> kathy griffin let me tell you something it's very bad practice to walk up on stage and physically assault a comedian now we all have to worry about who wants to be the next will smith in comedy clubs and theaters i don't know to each his own <laughs> tweet so we we just gonna start right there and i don't even know who the fuck that is but yes you guys that is the end of this reaction so you know um again i personally believe that will smith was in the right was it the right place or time no but however is there ever a right place or time realistically no <laughs> you feel what i'm saying like people are always so quick to say wrong place wrong time but it's like when is there ever a right place right time when you know what i'm saying have he would have let that go then him and jada would have went home and they would have had a whole argument in the car about jada not feeling protected as his wife and then now that's going to be on the back of his mind on his conscience of damn i should have said something she right i shouldn't have really let other people disrespect my wife why would i even do that you feel what i'm saying i respect will smith for smacking the dog shit out of chris rock chris rock do talk a lot of shit and he kind of had that coming for years and years to come i'm surprised it even took this damn long for him to get smacked for all the bullshit he be talking but you know i don't want to keep repeating myself i'm on will smith's side for me personally y'all let me know down in the comments whose side are y'all on do you agree with will smith protecting his wife or do you feel that he could have protected his wife in another format or another way? You guys let me know down in the comment section. But make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share. Show your girl some love. Help your girl get to a thousand subs. Make sure to leave some suggestions down in the comment section down below. And please give me a big thumbs up for it helps to push my videos further out into the algorithm. I'm out this bitch.
deuces. We live in the world that's extremely so cruel. Hitting below the belt, man, that's not cool. My feelings is numb to the point where I got a fork and I'm just eating this sauce like it's food. Yum. Bitch, when I'm corny and ain't gonna be shit. Bitches is hoping I die when I'm sick. I might as well go to the sex store to buy me a strap on to wear cause they all on my dick. Worry about me, what I just do. Worry about me and what I just said. The audience look at your life as a boo. A fake as the snake when the real skin have shed.